Hi, it's Dr. Pierre Parody from Hazel Dean Family Chiropractic, and I want to talk to you today about selecting the proper pillow. Now, before I get into that, if we're not already connected, I want to invite you to connect with us. You can go to twitter.com forward slash Hazel Dean Cairo and click on the follow button, or you can go to facebook.com and search Hazel Dean Family Chiropractic Clinic. And what we do is we post on a regular basis on health topics such as nutrition, exercise, stress management, uh, chiropractic care, pretty much anything you need to live a maximized life. Now the reason why I want to talk to you about pillow selection is because I must get asked at least two to three times a week what is the best pillow for me. And really it all depends on your sleeping style because if you're a stomach, back or a side sleeper, um, the type of pillow that you're going to need uh, is going to be different. Now first things first, if you're a stomach sleeper, that's a habit that we need to break right away because you know when you're sleeping six seven eight hours a night and if you're on your stomach it means that your head is turned constantly and let's face it I, I wouldn't spend the next six seven eight hours talking to you like this because of the strain that it would put on my neck on my spine on the nerves so that's why that we need to stop uh, stomach sleeping as soon as possible. Now, your two other alternatives are going to be on your side or on your back. Now, if you're mostly a back sleeper, then what you'll need is just a small thin pillow that's just thick enough to support the natural neck curve in your neck. You don't want the pillow to be too thick because what will happen is that it's going to start pushing your head forward and that too will lead to problems right because it pushes your head forward so it puts strains on the neck and on the spine. Now if you're mostly a side sleeper what you need is a thicker pillow because you need to fill in the gap between the tip of your shoulder and your neck. Now one way to know if the pillow you're using is too thin is that if you find yourself sleeping at night and you put your arm underneath your head or your pillow and the reason why you're putting your arm mostly underneath your head on the pillow chances are it's because your pillows too thin and innately you're trying to lift your head back up one of the side effects that we see uh, when the arm gets under the pillow it's above our head is that uh, the fingers the, the hand the whole arm they start getting numb because we're compressing the blood vessels and the nerves so ideally when you're sleeping on your side you want your head to stay nice and straight just as if you're standing now I don't want to endorse any specific pillow but this is a pillow that I came across recently which really understands this concept uh, what you'll see, this is the side portion right here, and you see that it's elevated in order to fill in the gap between my head and my shoulder. So that way when I'm on my side, my head is staying level. In the middle, you can see that it dips in just so that I have enough support for the back of my neck. And then on the other side, it's elevated again when I'm uh, side sleeping to support my head. Now. I'll be honest, I myself, I don't use this particular pillow. Um, I don't have a fancy pillow. Um, all I did is I bought myself a nice big fluffy pillow. And the reason why is that when I'm on my side, I'm actually able to bunch it up so that it can fill in the gap between the tip of my shoulder and my neck. And then if I turn on my back um, at night, um, it's fluffy enough that my head actually sinks into it and I only have this, uh, just enough support again for the back of my neck. So uh, uh, selecting a pillow is really uh, a personal choice. You might have to go through um, a few of them until you find the right one for you. But uh, I hope you found this information of value. Um, if you did, please share it with your friends and uh, we'll talk again soon. Again, it was Dr. Pierre Parody from Hazeldean Family Chiropractic Clinic.